Hello everybody, this is that shy guy Matt. Uh, I have been delayed a few days because I had a big birthday and then I had a food coma and now I've had a migraine so I have missed getting out the penguin and Daryl Dixon. So I'm recording them now. It is a Tuesday morning. So hopefully these will be out by Tuesday night, Wednesday morning. I apologize for the delay. We are watching The Penguin. Episode 3 I believe. Um, great series so far. Been loving it. Uh, if you like what you see, like, comment, and subscribe. It helps the algorithm, which helps me in the end, which makes me want to do this even more. The more interested you are, the more videos I put out. Uh, I'd also love to hear from you guys, so please comment. <laughs> so with that said, let's just hop into this episode of The Penguin. Hi. I know. I know. This must be before the flood. Sorry guys, I'm... The volume's really low on this for some reason. So he has a family. I assume they all died in the flood since we haven't seen them. <laughs> Interesting. Nice half Latina. Okay. Cool. Yes, I'm wearing an ice pack for my migraine. Biggest right. He's taking advantage of you, Bucky. You see? You act like wanting more is a bad thing, but... You remember where we came from? We have more than enough. Mm. I know his cousin pushes drugs. Okay, so? Calvin. Hmm. So he's hanging out with his friends, and is this when it's gonna flood? They're gonna see an explosion. In the background, the wall comes down. I hate squid. Yeah, I know, I'm sorry. I didn't know we'd be here. That's because you're looking far away. The rich neighborhoods. If you were out there looking back at Crown Point, you'd say, "Man, what a shit hole." Probably. It's like anything could happen. Like an explosion. No. Okay. I don't know. There's. I feel like that's what they're gonna set up. Yep. It's just starting. Yep. The sea walls. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Uh. Okay. Remember he said, or somebody said to him, the girl, everything was wiped out where he was, so. Mystery drink is... Maybe mystery still? Rhymes with schmepsy. All these s are related, you know? I mean, 60 years ago, two Sicilian brothers jazzed all over the toe of that boot. <laughs> you driving me and Sophia tonight? I'm, I'm, I'm... I don't know if I want to drive Sophia, Falcone. We start you on one a week, huh? One thousand a week? I mean, I'm pretty desperate right now. I I'll take that out. I'll take a thousand a week. I want two thousand. <laughs> oh, negotiate. But no. Driving penguin around? I'd risk it for a thousand. Buy me some time. Hold on, boss, what if Oh gosh, talking to Sophia? She gonna ask him questions. Is Penguin here? Eh, he's in the other room. Who are you? <laughs> Welcome. Offer her a drink, maybe. I don't know. I would be so scared to say anything to her. It's the remote for the Tacky. <laughs> Worked on one of his cars. You're a mechanic. You're a bad liar. Then why can't you work a lighter? Hmm. Yeah, she's gonna do it. Hmm. You know, Oz used to be my driver. Did he tell you that? Come on. You're driving. Well, phew. Victor's off. People online were trying to guess if this kid's anywhere from the comics or the any of the cartoons or anything, but nobody, he's not from any of it. So we're wondering if he's a a character that's an offshoot of somebody else, maybe? There's a th few theories out there. Could be. I'm just guessing he's just a new character in overall. Unless he's like a head henchman. Henchman. Looks good, Miss Falcon. Oh, is this for the drops? Oz, meet Trey Bloom, our chemist. Mmm. Coming up with a new product? Okay. Don't. Any change in the moisture or temperature could wipe out the entire colony. 
thought she said you couldn't touch them. The psychoactive compound in the sap creates a potent euphoric stimulant. So it's a party drug. Hmm. Sure. I suppose. Yeah. You seem to know everybody's business in town. So now's your time to shine, Oz. <laughs> His girlfriend? I would not have my girlfriend over to Oz's place. Good to see she's alive, though. I was gonna say, he must have some motivation for still being okay. So you just drive this club owner around and he lets you stay here? <laughs> Does she not know who he works for? Because we already know how that are, that's gonna go. Don't work for the penguin. I'm leaving, Victor. FEMA camp anymore. I was just gonna ask, where's everyone living? Okay. Our families are dead. We'll go start we anew. We take care of ourselves now. Yeah. Tomorrow night. Wow. Good to let him know ahead of time, lady. Just drop that on him. Victor. Come with me. This is what you want, right? Oh, so this is a, uh, more than just I'm leaving. This is, we're splitting. You, you could come with me. Oh, okay. I mean, you got a thousand in your pocket, kid. Take it. Leave. I'm not sure that he let me go. Okay, now you gotta tell her who your boss is. Tell her. He's like a gangster. Tell her it's Oz Oz and Ka uh, Cobblepot. If I took off, I don't think that, um... You come and kill me. You know stuff that I, I shouldn't have, so... Yeah, that's more the reason not to stay. That is not who you are. Mm, true, but... He's in too deep. Stay somewhere nice. And get me a ticket. No, this isn't gonna work out. Uh, this is what happens when you get involved with gangsters. You're not gonna have your own life, kid. This is the last time you're gonna see her. Okay. Or she's gonna be killed by a Sophia or the Penguin, one of the two. Sophia! Zaluka. Where have you been? Where you been? Yep. All I see is a spoiled bride who got what she deserved. Thank you. I appreciate this. Nope, she's gonna kill that guy, I hope. It's weird that they would treat her so poorly when technically she'd be the next in the family to take over the business after Luca, right? I mean, I'm assuming. Are they gonna have that weaselly little guy take over after Luca? I don't know. What's all this? A little hospitality gift. My pal Link's eye. Triad deck. There you go. Yep. Get the triads on your side. You got me. I got Link. <laughs> Link, brought you some top shelf from the 44. I sent you a whole truck of cigarettes. Where's my cut? I got a real opportunity for you here. This is why we're here. We're calling it bliss. You know I'm not a rat, right? You know I never... Yeah, you're not gonna convince Oz to let you leave. He's gonna kill me. Yep. <laughs> oh, oh, well. And the bag's open. Ice, ice. Oz. Uh, stutter. Stutter. Sometimes <laughs> hands on the hood. That's a lot of money for a kid your age to be carrying around. I just got paid this week. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't have any money. Oh. Guess not. I see. Okay. Smart move. We ain't going at it alone. You know, we got support from within the family. Johnny VD. Our drops operation. Disaster. Embarrassing. Yeah. Right. Make a good team. For lying. <laughs> I'll have VD give the old man a ring. So now how are you going to get this magical phone call? I got a plan. Going to have somebody else call in? I mean, that's the only other plan you got. Welcome to life. What else do you want to tell me, kid? Right, I'll do the, uh, the, the steak, uh, um, uh, steak, f steak freed. Hey, don't do that. The man was speaking. Freeds. Steak freed steaks. Right away, sir. You're going to feel bad because I stood up for him? You got fight in you, Vic. You gotta let it out. <laughs> well, it's like mostly uh, um, Mexican and Dominican stuff. Yeah. Dominican, okay. The world ain't set up for the honest man to succeed. Mechanic's a good job. That should be the American dream right there. You know, beautiful story with a happy ending. The way the world works, Vic. America's a hustle. Hmm. Ramon Aguilar, you raised a good son. Hmm. He's definitely gonna feel guilty about leaving. What are you doing here? I need a favor. Congratulations on the nuptials. Tina, don't forget your panties. <laughs> I gotta say, boss's wife, I mean, that's Bush League. You are gonna get things out on the line. You get to fuck Tina's brains out on a beach with white sand somewhere. Sounds pretty good. Doesn't it? <laughs> People keep the penguin 
around as entertainment. <laughs> Make the f***ing cool. Yeah, his psycho matches her psycho, so... No, I think she's more scary. Vic here, I'm gonna be our bag man for the night. Alright, get out there and make us a f***ing ton of money. Get... I wouldn't ask you to do this if I didn't know you could handle it. I can't tell who wants this more. Me or you. <laughs> what you did to me, was it worth it? Come on. We're so close to getting what you want. <laughs> There you go. They can feel it. And that translates. Yeah, this guy. Falcons have a history with a triad. My father pushed you out, he relegated you to Chinatown. When he died, I opened a bottle of champagne. I danced on his grave. Everything humans do is rooted in psychological need. Hmm. Look at them. People lost their homes, their families. The world as they knew it. Dance! Somebody's gonna steal something from his backpack. Don't do it. Oh, this is that girl. The show's starting. Uh. Oh, there we go. Honey, what is wrong with you? Put it together, right? Yeah. Hmm, okay. When nothing delivers a better escape than bliss. That's why they gave it to us in Arkham. Ooh, nice. Good way to spin it. And whoever controls it will control the future of the drug trade. I can go to the Neon Dragons or the Odessa mob. I, uh, I don't care much who our sales reps are. Good play. Give it to me. Oh, I see. Now! And you want to bail for what? A piece of ass? I, I can't. I can't leave. The f You think I'm holding you hostage or something? Hey, hey. This is what it feels like. Uh, no. Being with me. I gave you clothes, money, a place to crash. You got all the opportunity in the world, right? In here. You want to know what's shameful, Vic? Working your whole goddamn life, having nothing to show for it. Yeah. You think you're nothing. You are nothing until the day you die. I thought you were smart, but that's the life you want. Guess what, Vic? Good news. You already got it. So go. Get the fuck out of here. You don't deserve this. <laughs> Why not? You got the keys. Okay, we know he's gonna get here. He's gonna change his mind and go back. I mean, that's what I would do with the script. He has a taste of this life. Easier than having a girlfriend, right? Yep. Is it done? Triads are in. It's fine. I fucked over. That what you wanna hear? You ratted me out. I ain't no rat! And I'm not the hangman. For what? So you could what? Become a capo? You're not even a made man. Still no rank. I still made out like a guy bandit. And you know what? It's worth it. Getting all that, that don't mean nothing to you maybe, but it does to me. And I could have a better life. Is he actually opening up? She's probably gonna like that he's actually honest with her. Sorry for everything that's happened to you. You meant something to me. Still do. I mean, that I ain't never gonna live down. I don't know where to go from here. I don't know how to trust you. <laughs> Uh oh. Think you can pay us? They've been watching you. So you're gonna see him? Ram the car? Ram the car, get Penguin and Sophia out. Yep, they're in perfect line of sight. Run him over. Pull it out from inside you. Do something. There we go. <laughs> Grab a gun, kid. You're in it now. Go oh, now! Uh, what about Sophia? Leave her! We're in it now, Vic. We're in it now. Okay. Okay, so that was Penguin Episode 3. Another good episode. A little slow at first, but we were getting backstory on Vic. Yeah, I'm glad they answered what happened, because... He said everything was wiped out. I didn't know, did he have family there? Were they killed? Uh, some of it, you know, of course, it was predictable. Like, I knew he was gonna kind of ditch his girlfriend because he knew she'd at least be safe and stay with the penguin. I wasn't expecting the end with the other family showing up and finding out he was double-crossing them too. But, you know, they, they should have expect They should have known you can't trust the penguin. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, loving the series. I'm still sad that he may not come back for another season. 
don't know if there's only gonna be one season, but he said he hated wearing that that fat suit and all the makeup to be the penguin, Colin Farrell. But uh, yeah. So yeah, um, that's about it for that episode. Uh, I will see you guys probably in the next episode. Um, and I guess that's it for now. It's just a good episode. Don't got a lot to say about it because it was just good. Uh, and I will uh, see you guys later. This has been That Shy Guy Matt. Bye-bye.